If you want to see nature in all its pristine glory, you have to come to Kandhamal. It is a whole new world where you get to see the mountains brush against the skies, experience wading through the clouds as you climb the steep slopes and listen to the wonderful symphony created by the gurgling of a forest stream, the chirping of myriad birds and the occasional roar of an animal. It is a world where all its inhabitants, trees, animals, birds, even insects live in perfect harmony with each other. It was to preserve this harmony that the Kotaghat Sanctuary in Kandamal district of Odisha was conceived. With the twin objectives of preservation of the pristine beauty of the forest and conservation of the animals living here, the Kotagard Forest was formally declared a sanctuary under the Wildlife Protection Act 1972 in 1981. Spread over an area of 399.5 square kilometer, Kotagard Sanctuary is home to several bird species. The chorus of their simultaneous chirping creates a wonderful melody. The sanctuary is home to 36 varieties of birds, out of which hill miner, parakeet, peacock, bee eater, peafowl, Indian hornbill, green pigeons, spotted dove, miniwets, woodpecker, and quail are found regularly. Kotagat is the only place in Odisha where one can find the endangered bird, green munia. Among the animals, elephants are the main attraction of the sanctuary. There is presence of 30 to 40 elephants here. Since the place shares its borders with Kalahandi and Raigada districts, a Kotagard Chandrapur elephant corridor has been created within the forest for free movement of the elephants. One can also find leopards, gaur, sambar, giant squirrel, spotted deer, rabbit and pangolins and reptiles such as king cobra, Indian python, rattlesnakes, cobra and monitor lizards are also found here. The sanctuary situated on the Baliguda Forest Division is rich in sal trees. Besides, trees like Bija, Asan, Bamboo, Siali, Ganga Siuli and Indian Iron are also found abundantly in these forests. Along with Salt Lake, various man-made ponds have been constructed to fulfill the water requirements of the animals. An anti-poaching gate has been built at Pipadi to safeguard the animals. In order to secure the forest, a nursery has been set up in Kotagard and plantation is carried out from time to time. The saplings are prepared and planted in the forest as per the requirements. Famous for its altitude, the Kotagard Sanctuary can be best witnessed during winters. Kotagard Sanctuary never disappoints nature and animal lovers who throng the sanctuary mostly between November and February. The melodious chirping of the birds is just the perfect foil for the sound of the cascading waterfall. 
There are numerous waterfalls in the sanctuary, but Ludhu waterfall in Subarnagiri is the most sought after. The beautiful waterfall at Dupi is another tourist destination. For visitors keen to witness wild animals up close, there is Bandaka. Butterfly Park in Daringbadi is another enticing spot for the tourists. Munda Sarukuti, about 100 kilometers from Pulbani in Raikya block, is famous for the mountain gorge. Besides the sanctuary, around 5,000 Kutia Kondha tribals reside in Belgar. Kutia Kondha are one of the most primitive tribes in Odisha who retain their unique traditional lifestyle even now. They largely depend on the forest for their livelihood. Belgar is also famous for its wooden bungalow nestled amidst lustrous green forests and a perennial stream built by the forest department. Sightseeing and animal watching can go merrily together here. Multiple watchtowers have been set up at Pipadi, Dimli and in the forest to monitor the movement of animals. Forest officials in charge of security of the sanctuary carry out patrolling at regular intervals and remain vigilant round the clock. The Kotagarh Sanctuary is about 330 kilometers from the state capital Bhubaneswar and 250 kilometers from Barampur and 60 kilometers from Baliguda. One can avail accommodation at forest rest houses in Pulwani and Baliguda. Apart from that, the accommodations are also available at Belgar and Daringabadi. The serpentine footpath amidst dense forests and hilly slopes at Kodagard gives the tourists the rare thrill and excitement of adventure. The murmuring streams, the chirping of birds and the sighting of wildlife add up to a memorable experience for the visitors. Natural beauty and conservation of animals is the primary feature of every sanctuary. But what makes Kotgarh special is its dense green forests, the wide rows of mountains and the wild, beautiful hilly streams. It is as if this is the birthplace of all creation, where all creations continue to live the way the Creator created them. A visit to Kodgarh certainly has the potential to make someone spiritual, even if only temporarily. <laughs> <laughs>